flower farm in Naivasha, Kenya has put in place the country's first floating solar power system in a bid to strike a balance between production efficiency and environmental protection. Apollo James tells us more. The floating solar power production equipment in the flower farm is not fixed like traditional solar panels. Instead, it floats on the water body of the farm's reservoir, the first of its kind installed in Kenya, which has slashed production cost and contributed to emission reduction. The system provides an ideal answer to the perennial energy supply problem long haunting the flower farm. Uh, Kenya has a real struggle to, to supply enough power to the corners, all the corners of the country. Um, we, we, we live day to day with day to day problems of consistency of power from them. Given that space on the farm to set up solar panels is limited, an energy company, Ecoligo, turns to the farm's reservoir for installation of the solar power production equipment with a view to meeting the electricity needs of the farm. It reduces the evaporation of water in the reservoir, so that means you have to pump less water. There are about one million people directly or indirectly making a living from flower export in Kenya. The floating solar system the flower farm invested has contributed to environmental protection and has also helped the farm further emerge out of the shadow of the COVID-19 fallout. So as the market is improved and our production is there. Um, yeah, so we, we hope obviously it will continue. This project aims to raise public awareness about the environment and calls for people to protect the earth with action. Apollo James, Switch television.